Rise, kings and queens of Narnia, all of you. Adaptations of C.S. Lewis's magical Narnia novels have been done over and over for decades. With each new generation, a new version of the story seems to pop up. Today on Screen Rant, we're taking a look at the latest reboot with Netflix. Because you have spoken first, your future and that world shall be good. There's not much to report on the reboot right now. What we do know is that Greta Gerwig has been linked to the director job since 2023, and confirmed earlier this year that pre-production has started. Gerwig knows the challenge of honoring Lewis's Narnia, while setting her apart from previous adaptations is a big job. So, what must Netflix include to capture the true essence of Narnia? One thing Netflix's reboot must explore is the deeper lore of Narnia. C.S. Lewis created an entire mythology in the series, touching on the creation creation of Narnia and the Magician's Nephew, and even cosmic laws like the deeper magic from before the dawn of time. Netflix has the opportunity to delve into this with series format storytelling, showing not just the adventures, but also the underlying magic and cosmic battles between good and evil. Imagine episodes dedicated to the creation of Narnia and more mystical aspects of Lewis's world. It's important that the Pavensi siblings have well-developed characterization. Previous adaptations have sometimes struggled with developing their arcs fully. Netflix Netflix has the chance to give each character more depth. While the Disney film gives us glimpses of Peter's leadership and Edmund's redemption, they left out the emotional complexity that C.S. Lewis wove into their stories. Susan's journey also deserves further exploration, particularly in The Horse and His Boy, and her later estrangement from Narnia in The Last Battle. Netflix should dig deeper into her internal struggle and her eventual loss of faith with Narnia, creating a much more layered character arc. The most well-known character of the Narnia books, Aslan is more than just a magical lion. While previous adaptations have done justice to his visual grandeur, they haven't fully captured what he represents. He is the core of Narnia's wisdom, sacrifice, and eventual spiritual elements. Though by modern standards, Aslan's connection with these staunchly Christian themes may not be so welcome, however, Netflix needs to balance his warm, approachable side with his awe-inspiring power. One book that deserves a deeper, more focused adaptation is The Silver Chair. This installment of the series is one of the darkest of the books, and explores depression, courage, and the power of belief. Eustace and Jill's journey through the giant-filled lands and the underworld, as well as the chilling confrontation with the Lady of the Green Kirtle, should be brought to life. One of the most poignant themes in the Chronicles of Narnia is the passage of time and the bittersweet sense of loss. This theme wasn't fully explored in the Disney adaptations, but it's crucial for Netflix to get it right. Narnia is a place of wonder, but also of impermanence, where childhood magic fades. There's so much more to Narnia than what we've seen before, and with Netflix Netflix's series reboot, there's a huge potential to go deeper into the rich tapestry C.S. Lewis created. What are you looking forward to about this new series? Thank you for watching Screen Rant and stay tuned for more streaming news.